Hi, y'all. How you guys? How you all doing? I hope you all are well. I am here and I have a video. I'm going to be harvesting these butterball potatoes. So let's get right into it. Here's a little haul I found out here. Cherokee. No, this is not Cherokee. This is Seminole squash. I think both of these are Seminole squash here that I found. And then I harvested some more borage. And they say you're supposed to use the, the leaves for the tea. So I thought I would get some more of that. Because I got plenty of it out there. Okay. Okay. Here we are. I had to make sure this was working. So, let's get here and uh, start with these butterball potatoes, okay? And I believe that this is working. Yeah, I think it is. So I'm just going to cut off. The stems here. And let's see what we got in here. Get these weeds out. All right, there's a little bitty potato look like. I don't know if something dug it up or what. But these are German butterball potatoes. So I'm gonna get some of this off of the top here. And uh, Okay. Yep. All right, we'll start out here. Got a couple. I didn't really do much to these toward the end. In the beginning, when the garden was booming, these are looking good. Now, you know butterball potatoes, they don't get all that big. I'm not looking for great big potatoes. I'm looking for edible potatoes. Okay. Okay, let me see these. Let's see if we got any more down here. Hmm, this is a pretty good one here. Look at that. Okay, that's a pretty good bunch there. Let's see what else we got over here. Let me see if I feel any more over here. There we go.
All right. Now let me get my uh, little trowel here and see if I see anything else that I feel in here on this side. And there's one. Might be about finished on this side. It's kind of cold. The sun was out, but I had some stuff that I had to do inside. And by the time I got out here, the sun is gone now, so the wind is blowing. And uh, it was a beautiful day today here in upstate New York, zone 6B. Okay, I don't think I feel anything else there. Uh, let me turn this pot around. All right, let's push these over. I think I'm going to use my hands first to make sure that I don't tear up stuff. So these are some nice ones. Mm -hmm. Really, really nice. See the size of these? Really good. I'm going to put those down there. Let's make sure I didn't miss any. Oop, there go one. Okay. Move these over. I got another container that I'm going to be doing also. These are really nice, really nice potato gel. Really, really nice. I am pleased so far. I can't complain at all. Wow, look at these two. Look at these two, y'all. Look. Mm -mm -mm. No complaints here. All right. So far, that's the two I get. Now I need to get my scooper and try to see if there's any more in here. Hold on, let me get that. Some kind of little bug flying around out here. Many frosts we done had, they should all be dead. But these bugs live a lot longer now, y'all. They do not die right away. You gotta have a freezing cold, cold weather before these bugs seem to die. Okay. Well, just making sure. Then I got them. Just making sure. All right. Okay, so that's that's what I'm seeing right now. 
Okay, so I'm going to take this phone down and I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got in this pile over here and then we're going to go over to the next container, okay? Okay, here's what I got out of this container. Okay. I think that's pretty good. There's some nice sized potatoes in there. I'm pleased with that harvest. Okay, let's get over to the next one, all right? Okay, let me put these gloves on. And we right here at the German butterball potatoes. I think I had some Yukon gold potatoes too. But the label in this pot blew out, so I don't know which one these are. But looking at them, I'm thinking they're the German butterballs. Okay, that's my seed potato. And I'll show them to you in, in a minute if you can't see them. All right. Let's get this dirt off. These pots are really dry. I'm surprised. It had been raining, but it hasn't rained in a few days. Okay, so here's what we have here. Alright, let's put those down there. Let's see what else. There was only two in here. There was only two. As far as I could tell, potatoes put in here. Okay, that's those. I'll put those down there. And I'm just gonna see if I see anything else over here. About a one that I thought was there. Oh, I stabbed one. Mm. Oh, there's some more in here. Okay, this one that I stabbed, I think I'm going to lay to the side so I won't put it in the pan with the other ones because I don't know if I'll see it or not. Once I get it inside. Okay. I'm going on the edge here. That's where I found that one at. I'm on the edge. There's a little toy in here. Just gonna make sure there's no more over here. Yep, there's another one. Be careful right here. Maybe there's more in here. Uh. Oh, no. Okay, I'm not feeling anything else, so that's what I got so far. So let me uh, put them down there. I'm going to turn this bag around. All right. Rake. Rake this stuff over here. All right. I can tell there's one right here that was playing it, so let's pull that up. Okay. we got some nice ones there. Put them down there. Let's 
see what else is in here. We got any more. See one. I wasn't expecting too much out of here. I only had two two potatoes put in here. This was uh, I had a few left over, and I just stuck them in here. Ooh, kind of compacted down there. Okay, so there's one. I guess I'm going to have to dig down more. I hope I don't stab any. If there's any in here. That might be all in here. Just double checking y'all. Okay. I'm not feeling anything else. Just trying to go along the side. Okay, I don't see anything else, so we're gonna call that done. And um, and two slips. I'll show you. I'll show you what I got here. I have two two slips there. Okay, can you see that? All right, I'm trying to make sure all of them are in the camera. Okay, so that's what I got from the two slips that was in there. Okay, so I got a bag here. And I'm putting all my potatoes in this bag. Okay, so that's that. Now I have, I'm trying to see if there was another. Okay, I'm going to come back. It's either going to be sweet potatoes or uh, another probably mer uh, purple majesty. Let me see what I got. Okay, let me see. Can I situate this a little bit? Turn it a little bit, y'all. And lower it down a tad. Uh. Okay. I'm going to get these gloves on. And this is the Purple Majesty potatoes. Take this light out of here. Lay that over there. Head off this here. Alright, 
let me get some of this mulch off the top. I don't know anything about the Purple Majesty. I just bought them because they had them in the store. And uh, I was buying locally. And I saw them. And I said, let me try these, okay? I don't know how big they're supposed to get or anything. If they long keepers or whatever. There go two little ones. So let me uh, start going for them. The only thing I really know about them is they be purple. I don't even know if they turn colors after they cook. I'll have to go. When I go inside, I'll have to research them. Okay. So that's them. I'm going to put them over here on this tarp. It's just weird seeing this color. <laughs> I'm not used to it. I'm looking at them like something's wrong with these potatoes. But that's what color they be. Okay. So far, so good. Cause I think it's only what like two in here there was a one I pulled out I think there was only two in here I know I only bought one thing of them so whatever came in there if it was two or three or whatever was in that one package that I bought that was all that I had bought and I bought that from a local store here And the only thing I did was put in my cow manure and bone meal uh, and weed fertilizer. Those are the only things that I used this year. I cut back on all that other stuff. I don't think we need all that. Okay, that's these. One thing I think, uh, uh, at least I think I do, I can't speak for anybody else just putting too much I never really put a lot but I think what I was putting in there was too much I've never put a lot compared to what I see some other people look at that one big one compared to what I see other people putting in I never have put that much in but I just felt like what I did put in was too much so I kind of cut back because I feel like these containers I'm growing in a container and these containers, let me put these up, okay? Over here on this tarp. I'm just gonna dig down over here, see if there's any more over here. Okay. I just always felt like I was using too much. I always believe in the natural stuff like cow manure or compost um, you know stuff like that that's what I really believe in bone meal if, you, if I bought any kind of all-purpose fertilizer or bought any of it I always felt like I was doing too much that's just me my weed fertilizer is really working out and all these leaves I got out here, huh? I'm going to be using them, baby. They free. And I got a whole bunch of trees around me. Okay, so I got these here. Put that over there. I see some more up here on this top, so let's get them off. Um... Okay, that was two, as far as I can tell, there was two, um, 
potatoes that I put in here. I didn't cut them or anything. I just, whatever, whatever came in that package, it was either two or three. Now, from judging from what I'm seeing here, it looked like two. Okay, and so it's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. Okay. Let me get over here. Got one there. Let's double check over here again. They all seem to be pretty close to the top, so I didn't really have to jump the pot. There's one. But I have to be careful because they kind of blend in with the dirt. another it's a smaller one okay I want to try to do one more container so, I don't see anything else in here. So, that's them too. I'll show you what I got here. And then, at the end, I'll show you everything. The total of everything. Okay? Alright. So, let's move over to this other container. Alright? Okay. So, here I am at the sweet potatoes. And I believe these are the Georgia Jets. And as far as I can tell, I had one, two, three. Looks like four in here, okay? Here's one right here on the top. So, uh, let me go with that one. Try to get it out. Mm. I might have to dump this out probably. Probably got to dump it out, y'all. I forgot I had to dump this out. I forgot this is sweet potatoes. They got to be dumped. Uh, I'm going to try to get this done before I lose all my light out here because it's going to be some rain some other days and I wanted to try to get this done before the rain uh, can you see these over here yeah you can see them okay uh, let's see okay there's one pretty nice very nice Mm. Okay. See these? This one here is really nice. Nice as potato. Uh, let's see about this. 
Whoa. Whew, whew, whew. Look at this. Wow. Very nice. Okay, that was where maybe I won't have to jump it. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, I gotta jump because I can I can feel stuff toward the bottom. Mm. Mm. Okay. Hmm. Well, that might be all that one had to give. It gave some big ones and that was it. Okay. We got these here. Get that out of there. Well, I don't see anything else. I thought I had felt something. I don't see anything. Oh, let's see what's over here. Oh. oh, okay. Here's something. That's nice. Very nice. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and start putting this stuff back in this pot. That way um, I'll know if I'm missing anything. Okay, y'all, my camera stopped uh, recording there at the end, so I'm in the garage, and I just thought I would just show you because, I, you know, I w said I was going to show you everything all together. So these are all the potatoes, and they are mixed together in this bag, okay? Over here, I showed you these two Seminole squash that I got. This was another one I found out there. Um, these are the potatoes, the sweet potatoes, okay? It's not the greatest light in here. Um, this one here is really big. I can't even get the whole thing on here. Uh, it's a, a big one. And then these here, some good size. Good eating potatoes, these over here. Good eating size. Okay, so that's it. I got a whole bunch more containers out there to do. So, this ain't it. Okay? So, if you like the video, go ahead and give me the thumbs up. If you don't know about my channel, go ahead, check it out. If you like it, subscribe. You won't be disappointed. Okay? So, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.